What's up guys, this is iTweets here with iPhoneHacks.com and today I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak iOS 7 on Windows. Now I know it's been a while since Evasion has come out but I actually haven't done a video on how to jailbreak on Windows and I wanted to go ahead and do that and I haven't jailbroken my iPad 3 just yet so I wanted to give it a shot. So this is actually pretty easy. I have used Windows to jailbreak before. So all you're going to want to do is go to evasion.com and I'll put a link in the description below for you guys to just click on. And since we're on Windows, we're just going to click on Windows and then it's going to bring you to a mega screen right here. Then you're just going to want to click download. Now, once you download this, I've already downloaded it. You want some type of program like WinRAR that's going to be able to extract the file. So if you don't have WinRAR, then I'll go ahead and put a link in the description below for that as well. So let's go ahead and minimize this because I've already downloaded it. And once you have WinRAR, it should automatically open up just like this. You're going to have your readme text and you're going to have evasion.exe. So all you want to do is double click on evasion and it's basically as simple as that. You just open up the program and you're going to click jailbreak. Now one thing I always recommend is go ahead and make a backup of your device before you actually try to jailbreak. Now just make sure that your device is plugged into your PC and click jailbreak. And then it's going to start going through its process right here. If you've jailbroken before with Evasion 7 then you know exactly how this is going to go. But I'm going to go ahead and speed up through this that way we don't have to sit through the entire thing. Alright, so now that we're rebooted, it says on our screen to continue, please unlock the device and tap the new Evasion 7 icon. So just go ahead and unlock the device here. And there should be an Evasion 7 icon here, right there. So just tap that. Should open up, close, and then continue with its process. All right, so now we're rebooted here. You can see, let's go ahead and change that orientation. If we swipe to unlock, we should have Cydia on our device right there. So we're going to go ahead and tap on that. Let's give it just a second to load. Okay, there it goes. Now it's going to prepare the file system the very first time that you open this up. And this may take a while, so give it some time. Alright, so now that we're rebooted, let's go ahead and swipe over here and let's go open up Cydia. So here, since it already prepared the file system, just tap user, tap done. And then once it loads, you're going to have Cydia. So a very painless process. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Alright guys, until next time, this is iTweaks with iPhoneHacks.com.